Now to the latest details on a fire that significantly damaged a church in Montgomery County. The fire started just before two this morning at the Spencerville Church on New Hampshire Avenue. Our John Duran has more on what officials believe caused that fire and how church leaders are adjusting worship service plans today. Montgomery County fire officials say this was likely an accidental electrical fire that started inside the Spencerville Church. Firefighters were called to the scene around 1:45 in the morning. Now from the outside, you can't really see any damage, but inside fire officials say there's more than $5 million in damages done. The church says its head pastor was at an event in Wyoming when he learned about the fire. They also say he's on his way back today after learning the news. We also spoke to a uh, member of this church who came to check out the damage for himself. He says this church has exceptional programs for both seniors and youth and he hopes those programs are able to stick around. There's a lot of members that have been coming here for most of their lives, um, and I'm concerned of what's gonna happen as things you know, change. But I also have a lot of confidence that, um, that the area churches will be able to take that on and uh, have a place for people to worship. Uh, I'm not worried about that. I just worry about what it's gonna do to the, the collective community. That's my concern. There were a number of services planned to be held at this church over the weekend. Olson tells me they've been moved to the Seventh-day Adventist headquarters, which is on Route 29, just about 10 minutes away from here in Silver Spring, as they begin to assess the damage and make what I would expect would be major repairs inside to return things back to normal here. In Silver Spring, John Duran, WUSA 9.